But you mentioned Mike McCarthy. Mm-hmm. Mike McCarthy, bruh, Mike McCarthy, it, I, I think I, I kind of feel for him. I kind of want to give him a hug. You look at Mike McCarthy's record as a head coach. You look at his winning percentage. You look at what at, at what he's accomplished. Man, put, put a little bit more respect on this man's name. And I'm not just talking about non-Cowboys fans. Cowboys fans. They're like, oh, Mike McCarthy. He ain't nothing. Can't wait till Dan Quinn takes over. Hey, as if Mike McCarthy hasn't won a Super Bowl. As if Mike McCarthy hasn't developed a quarterback. Yes, I'm giving him credit. I'm giving him Aaron Rodgers. Because nobody knew what Aaron Rodgers could do. Till Mike McCarthy gave him he, the Aaron offer. Rodgers, Aaron Rodgers is going to be the number one pick in the draft. Let's let's not let's not go overboard. Here's but why he was drafted by twenty fourth. Yeah, he was drafted by twenty fourth, and he turned out to be maybe right. the greatest quarterback to ever played the game. But that's a conversation for one another day. All right. Short list. Here's why. Here's why Mike McCarthy doesn't get the credit that you believe he deserves. And we're going yeah. to have story time with you. Want to have story time with Vinny? Let's have story time with Vinny. Let's All have right? some story time. All right, let's do it. A metaphor. Not only story time, metaphor. We can, you know, do it both okay. ways. So when I was in college. Before you tell that story, I'm still tripping over your boy in the driveway, revving the engine so his <laughs> wife could hear. <laughs> Letting her that, know that, story, that he really that, means business. <laughs> I really mean business, but this car is not moving. But I want to let you know that it could. Then I got it the keys go. at least. I got the keys. And I know I know where the gas pedal is. I'm not gonna mm -hmm. move it, but I want you to mm -hmm. know. That was a deep story. That was deep. Anyway, go ahead. Go ahead. I've I've never let him forget that for and he'll never forget that for the rest of his life. Story time with Vinny. I went when I was in college, when I was a, a young whippersnapper, there were, you know, I used to hang around older guys. And a couple guys that I hung around were Dirty Mac. You know what Dirty Mac is, Michael Holly? Dirty Mac What's is a dirty dude. Mac? Dirty okay. Mac is a dude that hit on anybody's woman, right? Don't matter. Don't matter right. if you got a woman. Everybody knows this is such and such as woman. I'm hitting on. Them. I know a lot right? of people like that. Exactly. I know a lot of people exactly. like that. <laughs> okay. And and, right. and, it, and it's in, and it's in, and it's college, right? So you know whatever. Right. So. You know, I'm like, one day I looked around, I was like 18 years old. So, I, you know, I was, I was new to the game. I was new to the game. So I asked them, I asked one of the guys one day, I said, hey, man, you hang around, you hang around this girl's boyfriend. Why are you trying her? And he says, it's not my job to respect that relationship. If, oh. she, doesn't re if, if she doesn't respect the relationship, why should I? To so bring it back to the Cowboys? Nobody respects the head coach because Jerry Jones doesn't respect the head coach. So, so why should the player? Why should the media? Why should the fan? Because any head coach has been worth his salt since Jerry Jones has taken over. Has been two guys, Bill Parcells and Jimmy Johnson. And what happened? They was getting too much credit, so he had to go get puppets and figureheads. He had to go get people he liked like a son. He had to go get people he could control. So if you're going to set that pattern, why should I care if Mike McCarthy won a Super Bowl over a decade ago? We don't get Aaron Rodgers that country. Why am I going to give Mike McCarthy that bail when he's given away far more playoff games than he's won? That's why we don't respect, I don't say we, but as a general public. That's a okay. long way of saying it. That's a long way of saying it, but you get well, the drift. Hey, look, I get your drift, and that's a fair point, but a couple things on this. One, if we're gonna if we're gonna treat Mike McCarthy that way, if he's the guy who's giving away playoff games and he's giving away more than he's won, then leave Aaron Rodgers don't alone. Don't you do it? Don't you do it? For, don't you do for, it? For don't, you, only, don't you disrespect for, that man? But leave him alone. No, leave, no I'm saying leave Aaron Rodgers alone. Leave him alone. When Aaron Rodgers has been to one Super Bowl, the same. If I'm not mistaken, the same Super Bowl on the same plane that Mike McCarthy took. So they went to the same Super Bowl that won. They both won. Uh, that that one, okay, T together. That's it. So if you're gonna talk about Aaron Rodgers, he only won one, and no, don't criticize him. He's it's won, not his fault. He's won four MVPs, Michael Holly. Four, four, short of the Bill Cosby. One, two, three, four, five, five. He's won four Who? MVPs. 
<laughs> we don't talk about Ali. him anymore. Oh, that's right. We can't. Yeah, can't talk about. Him. Sorry about. That. Okay, so we'll talk about him. But I, I got it. Yeah. yeah, it's good. Yeah. All right. So that's that's one. And here's the other thing. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I understand. It's not your job to respect the relationship and all that. If you have an opportunity to be the head coach of an NFL team, any NFL team, oh, you know, you got to think about it. Even if it's the worst owner in football, uh, as you let's bring it back to the Lions. So let's say it's a Ford family. Let's say it's the Haslam's uh, in Cleveland. Shad Khan, you know about the worst owner, the worst owner in football. If you got an opportunity to be a head coach. I think you better you better think long and hard before you say no. You see the money they're making, only 32 of those jobs. It can advance your career even if you don't do a good job there, but you got the you got the profile is good for business whether it's for 2 years, 5 years, 6 years. And then two, it's the Dallas Cowboys. You may think they're America's joke. I like your feed item. You may think they're America's joke, but most people most people disagree with you. It's a respected brand. And so why not give it a shot? Anyway, Mike McCarthy, I'm happy for you. Even if Cowboys fans aren't happy for you, Jerry Jones is not happy for you, and Dan Quinn's not happy for you. Michael Holly on a Tuesday in September is very happy for you. Hey, thanks for watching Brother from Another on YouTube. Make sure you hit subscribe before you leave and be sure to watch us 3 to 5 p.m. Eastern Time on Peacock. Appreciate you.